What's up guys, it's Moose here, and today I'm going to be talking about the four types of classes that are going to be going on in the fall for UNT. A lot of students have been very confused about the types of classes, how they're going to be working. So as a student, I went through the Registrar's Office website, and today I'm going to be talking about the classes and how they're going to be working. So let's get right to it. So for the fall semester for 2020, uh, there's going to be about five different types of classes. There's going to be the 100% online class. There's going to be a 100% remote learning class. There's going to be partial remote learning class partial online classes, and of course, in-person classes. So with that in mind, if you were to go into your MyUNT account right now and look at your class schedule, you should be able to tell what type of classes that you have in your descriptions. So let's discuss what each of these classes mean. Online classes for UNT are exactly how they sound. They're going to be 100% online. You're not going to have to go anywhere. You can literally take the classes in your room as long as you have internet. Um, they're going to be much more self-paced, so you're not going to have any specific times where you have to sit down for a Zoom lecture. So if you have an online class, just know that it's going to be much more self-paced and you're going to have to keep track of everything and you're going to really have to know the due dates for every single assignment because you're responsible for them yourself. 100% remote classes, however, are going to be slightly different from 100% online classes. Uh, in the fact that for remote classes, you're going to have a specific date and time where you have to sit down and actually watch the lecture and your professor is probably going to be doing like a live stream through Zoom. So if you have a remote class, make sure to look at the time and dates for them and make sure that you don't have anything scheduled during that time because you're going to have to sit down and actually attend class in order for you to be able to be successful. Compared to 100% online classes and 100% remote classes, partially remote classes and partially online classes are going to be slightly different. For those classes specifically, they're going to be much more like hybrid classes. So on certain days for partial remote classes, you might have in-person classes where you have to go to a specific class or you have to go to a specific location. So I recommend looking through your MyUNT and looking through your teacher's emails to see what days and what times you actually have to show up for in-person classes and what days it's going to be remote. For partially online classes, there might be certain days where you actually have to sit down and actually have a partially remote class. And there will be other days where it's going to be much more like the traditional online class where you just have your assignments, do on certain days, and you just go save pace. So one of the biggest things I recommend for partial classes is keep a really close eye on your emails and keep a really close eye on your syllabus and teacher instructions so you can actually keep on track of everything. For online classes and remote classes, self-discipline is one of the biggest things that is key in order for you to be successful. Keep on track of your syllabus, keep on track of your schedule, keep on track of every single assignment so that you can really be successful and actually like plan everything out ahead of time because that is the key to pass online classes and remote classes. So, so far we've talked about online classes, remote classes, partial online classes, partial remote classes. The last class you can have is the traditional in-person class. In-person classes are going to be slightly different for the fall. For example, you're going to be required to have masks on in class and they're going to be accounting for social distancing, so you're going to be sitting very far away from each other and are going to have very small class sizes. So when you're going into the in-person classes, keep social distancing into consideration, wear a mask and follow UNT rules and keep safe. And yeah guys, that was my very short video on the types of classes that are being taught for fall 2020 at UNT. I just wanted to make this video because I know a lot of things are very confusing and I was confused at first too until I started figuring out these answers by going online. So I hope you find this video to be useful. If you like these videos, please like and subscribe. And in the description below, I'm gonna have the resources where I found all this information too so you can go and look everything up yourself. I hope you have an amazing day.